probably giving birth to my first two kids. I'll get into the third one in just a second. Um, it was so nice. Um, and with the second one, I wasn't in any pain at all. I had them both C-section. Um, with the first one, I felt all of that, but when I held her in my arms, it was just so amazing. And um, with my son, that was amazing too. And it was so nice to not be in any pain and just to look at him for the first time. Um, do you get along with your family? Yes, I do. Um, my father I didn't get along with, but he's no longer here. Um, if you had to name one situation that would overwhelm your courage, what would it be? When I had my third baby, she was diagnosed with um, persistent pulmonary hypertension in newborns. And um, after I had her, right away she started turning blue and started gasping for air and um, she was in the NICU for six weeks and I couldn't hold her or touch her um, or even talk to her. She was that critical. Um, they didn't want the mother around because they were they were afraid she'd have a heart attack and they thought that um, she was going to have to have an artificial lung placed in her neck and it was just um, she's healthy today by the way but it was just something that no one should have to go through and um, you know, a couple times they told me that they didn't think she was going to make it, and it took a lot out of me, um, but we made it through, and um, they told me that she might have hearing problems and vision problems and just all kinds of problems. Um, they had put her on nitrous oxide and um, she made it through all that and um, just it's just very it's hard hard for me to talk about but um, we pulled through um, which do you enjoy more, scary movies or happy endings? Happy endings, of course. What is one thing you are grateful for today? The health of my children and being in remission. Um, today I'm cancer free and hopefully it will stay that way. Um, what is one thing scientists should invent? Hmm.